Hello South Africa. Today is Thursday, March 24, 2022 and here is news in a minute. For injured when three Golden Aero buses set alight in taxi strike. For passengers sustained injuries when three Golden Aero buses were set alight on Thursday morning amid the Totsi strike in Cape Town. Three buses were attacked and set alight in Nianga, Blocombos, Crefentine, and Alban Road. The Golden Aero bus service, GABS, said spokesperson Bronwyn Dykbeyer said the motive is still unknown, but it appears to be linked to today's taxi industry strike. She added that they managed to save two buses. The third bus was completely gutted. Four passengers were injured and treated. We condemn this in the strongest possible terms. This cannot be allowed to continue. Our passengers and employees must be able to travel safely without fear. We call on the authorities to please take the necessary step and to ensure that there are boots on the ground when situations such as these occur. Chaos has broken out on the city's roads with burnt vehicles and reported injuries, and parts of the N2 highway were also brought to a standstill on Thursday. The police in the Western Cape said it along with the province's other law enforcement authorities have been deployed to maintain law and order during the ongoing taxi protest. The South African National Taxi Council, Santoco, Kata and Kodita have been granted permission for a joint march to the office of the Western Cape Premier. The two associations, the heart of the deadly taxi violence in the city in 2021, will present a memorandum with a set of grievances to Alan Wind. Santaco spokesperson Gashon Gaia said the grievances are especially related to taxi drivers who operate in townships. They also made a decision that none of their vehicles will be operating tomorrow. Kata and Kodita gave Santaco the assurance that there will be no interference and intimidation of the other regions that will be operating as per normal, said Gaia. This is Leah for the South African.